much to, to have Wayne back. How happy are you to see him back? And, and obviously, I'm sure you know, feel for him during the uh, it's always good, you know, when you get a guy back in the building, especially a guy like Lane. I mean, all pro guy like Lane, one of one of the guys, you know, that's always been around. You know, one of the one of the best offensive tackles in football. So it's always good when you got a guy like him back in the locker room. Um, and you know, I, of course, you know, we, he know we, he know we all got his back. And um, I think, like I said last week, you know, we all got our problems. You know, and uh, you know, you everybody got a different a different deal. But you know, you got to feel for a guy. You, you know, you. You know, you see him and you, you try to pick him up and, you know, just talk to him and just, you know, and just be normal, you know. I think that's all he wanted to love and know that, that the guys in the locker room got his back. Yeah, I said he's doing better. I've seen that. Yeah, absolutely. You know, you got to, you know, you got to, obviously, a guy, he's been out of the building for, for some time and, you know, um, he shouldn't feel bad about nothing, you know. Um, like I just said, we all have, you know, real life problems. We're all human. And I think that, you know, sometimes people, um, they don't realize it. They forget. They think they were bulletproof, um, and and that's the, that's the funny part about it. So, um, like you said, we all got his back, and uh, we look forward to seeing him on 65 on the field on Sunday. As a veteran, what's your I, I guess reaction, or how do you interpret it when a, a longtime player like Ertz gets traded? I hear you. When a longtime player like Ertz gets traded, how do you react to it? What's your interpretation of it? That kind of. Uh, I mean, it sucks, you know. Um, but you got to know that it's a business, you know. Um, I mean, obviously, um, I'm. I'm I'm pretty sure, you know, that's not probably what Zach wanted. But, you know, at the same time, you know, I'm sure he's happy. You know, I talk to him, he's smiling, FaceTime, he's smiling. And um, that's all you can ask for a guy, you know, know that he'll be missed. Um, he did a lot for this organization, a lot for this city. Um, he's, I mean, he was my teammate since since he got here nine years. And, uh, you know, I'd be, be be really happy for him to go out and, you know, um, and see him in a – it would be strange seeing him in a different color jersey. But, like I said, I'm just happy for him. We've seen more snaps for you the last few weeks. Uh, on that last drive, though, there was a period there where you weren't out there. Was there, was there something uh, wrong, or is just the way the, the way the, the, the rotation was going? To my the last drive of the game on Thursday. Against the Buccaneers, yeah. Well, I think they've completed the first down. I don't think I think we had like one timeout or something. And I think if you know football at that point, the game's kind of over.